might be tough to come by today. This cold front came in. Yeah, we had a tough time finding Chad the last couple weeks. I know, when you don't need them, they're everywhere. That's how it was for me. He's starting to get on them now. All right, we're finally out here getting to do a day of catfishing. Don't want to get out here for a while. Got the shad loaded up. Just pulled up this brush pile. Got a creek mouth up there about, oh, 20, 30 yards. Let's see how it goes. A little windy out here. It's a fight in the wind, but should be able to get on them. He's on there. Him smacked it. He's gonna come out the boat. Not a very big one. Coming right at me. He's hooked though. Tell you what. Nice blue right there. His hooks, so what is that old Gamagatsu? Yeah. This rod's getting, getting a hit too. Come back with the old double. This is right off the back of the boat. Are you kidding me? Missed it. What happened? I think I missed him. Are you kidding me? There must be little ones out here. Are you kidding me? I can't have a hard time fishing off these rod holders. Be careful. Yeah. <laughs> so at least it was sturdy. That's nuts. Alright, just switched spots, came down the river. Oh, a couple miles. This place we like to fish down here on this bend, bend of this river. Drops off into a deep hole. Done pretty good here in years past. Let's see if we can get on a few here today. You hooked up? Nice blue. I believe it the way it's going today. You got it? Yeah, true look. Don't horse him. Don't horse him. Yeah. I get too far from that pole though. A little bit bigger size. <clears throat> How to go with the uh, rod out of the rod holder. I think it makes me miss a lot of fish. Shane didn't seem to have a problem though. Might just be me. Back set up. Just moved down a couple hundred yards. 
chain was catching a few. Move down a little further, try to get back in that hole. Hopefully this works out a little better for us. Feels like a good one. So we're here eating my lunch. Yeah. He's not super huge, but decent one. Nice. That's a little raspy right there. Over here, chowing down. Give me some red diamond sweet tea. Eat an old knot sandwich. That get better than that right there. We'll take it. Get him. Yeah, let me see here. He was hooked right off the rip. So I like to see. Bam. Elite. There we go. Gotta get some hands on that. Swimming at me. Ow, oh, drum. Ah, we don't like that. Swimming right at the boat. Feels like a good one. Oh yeah, nice, that's a fat one, ah, we need a net, oh come on Shane, just grab him, don't grab the line, yeah, yeah, that's what, that's what we're talking about, a little sobers and outdoors, it's all right. He's gonna be eating. Yeah, nice. A little bit bigger size. God dang. Toad. I don't know if I've mentioned yet, but we're using cut shad. Usually cut cut them into thirds use the head and I like the middle section kind of make sure the hook is exposed no scales on that hook I don't like catfish unless I have fresh bait I don't usually bring bait with me if we either don't catch shad we don't we don't catfish but um, we get back in the water so we can't catch another one it's been a great day so far Ran out all the shad we had, probably had about 20 shad, ran through them. Gonna go down here, down river, towards Twin Bridges. See if we can't pick up a few more shad. Beautiful day out here though. That's a shad right there. He's hooked. Looks like a one. Hello, blue. Come 
going to run with it. Striking at it right now. Come on. Tiny catfish right there. That's how we do it though. Still caught him. Made it back home off the river. Had a good day out there. Caught some slabs. A whole bunch of through back. Quick trip out. Catfish starting to bite. Should be a good spring. Got out there tagging some or tagging some outdoors, servicing outdoors, pour them up. Gonna clean these babies up and head on home. Hope you enjoyed the video. We'll catch you next time. Thanks.